Hey, you good know, for you. I saw each other. Yeah. Been down for a couple weeks. Uh -huh. Family down, daughter, wife, uh -huh. everybody's down. Yeah. Great. See my progress in a minute. All right. <laughs> That's the way you got to do it, man. Yeah. And look, full swing, smooth. You just, you know, you got, the only way you can get better is hanging around guys that know what they're doing. That's right. You know it? Yeah. That's true. Hey, and yeah. I mean, you know, I tell you what, most people out here, they like, they, they help. Yeah. They help. Yeah. You know, they like to see you. They like to see you hit it good. Trying to get a, a lower body action that I like. Yeah. 
Let me tell you what, I was watching the video of the rear view of Matt Tiama. Uh-huh. Oh. Holy crap. I mean, he, he, the way he gets in here, the way he sets there, then. Uh -huh. yeah. Oh, I love it. Yeah. Because it sets up with my actions that I had when I played racquetball and all that stuff. It's just things, you know, it's just, yeah. just a matter of, you gotta know what you're looking at. You know, it's, it, it's, and that's why golf is so difficult for a lot of people is because golf is just not something that has, it's golf is a game that you have to understand what you're doing. Now you can get lucky and hit the ball, but even the best players in the world still search knowledge from somebody. Oh. That's why they got teachers and stuff. Right. Because, yes, they can hit it, but they still trying to find, to understand why. Because the moment you understand why something works, why it makes sense, uh -huh. it makes it go there every single time, then if you know something, whether it's anatomical, whatever, if you know that it can repeat itself, then you can repeat a swing because you can build a whole swing around a move that repeats every time. Yeah. That's what, what did I say before? About Calvin Pete. Oh yeah. That the, because his elbow couldn't bend, yeah. that right there, his whole body had to be conducive to that action. Yeah. So no matter what he did, he had to keep that and his swing had to match it. Uh -huh. That's just skill. And I didn't even swing that. You didn't swing at it, did you? Nope. But that's what a lot of people don't, that's why when you see these guys with these unique swings, it's something that made that act, it's something that repeats that action. They have to keep doing it, you know what I mean? It's just like, like you see the Matthew Wolf who comes up here, boom, he goes. But then you saw, like, like we were talking about Jordan at one day, where, you know, he had that little chicken wing and then it's almost like they're trying to take that away yeah. to some degree. But the thing is, that right there was, that may have triggered what the actual move uh -huh. was in the, the, you know, to make the golf swing truly, truly work. And it's just like, if you don't have the knowledge to understand that, then that's how you might lose your swing. That's how guys like that lose their swing. And I mean, it's just like, you can tell I'm not over jacking the hip. And that's what Tiger can't do anymore. He can't spin no hip, but he damn sure can do this one. He can sit there and do this one. Never seen anybody swing a golf club with their hip. Mm -hmm. You swing a golf club with your arm. That's why your hands are holding on to it. Say, say what you got, Megan. Come on, let's see what you got. <laughs> see what you 
that. Gets a good setup. Get gets, gets a good grip. Gets a good grip. I say, hey, what you do? Uh, where's the first tee and what's the course record? <laughs> that was the second. Charles, he, when he, I met him about what about a month and a half, two months ago, and he yeah. was out here. Now we're just doing this. And I didn't know. I, I, I was looking at him, and he was set up late like a fucking pretzel. He looked like a fucking. He looked like a fucking pretzel. I said, Listen, I can tell you played some damn sports before, but you, would you mind if I just told you to do a couple things? <laughs> I mean, I mean, he was. I mean, I mean, by God, he. I mean, I. <laughs> And so I, I'm gonna tell you what though, I told him like, like how to hold it and how to stand up. That's a, so you know he, and he started he started just fooling with it. He still wasn't getting it very good, but I left and went up there. About 30 minutes later, I looked down and here he here he is. <laughs> yeah, he brought the setup. I mean perfect. Yeah. yeah. If you don't have a good setup, yeah. you don't want to have a good setup. But I'm, he picked it up so quick. I, I mean, went back to Minnesota and I practiced oh, everything you told me. Get in front of a mirror, get you know, look see see yourself. Get, yeah. See yourself from the front. See yourself from you, you can you can see yourself. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. You bet you. better. Hey, yeah. Because if you check is in the mail. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> free beer tomorrow. Yeah. Hey, free Don't beer set up for free beer today. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. You know, it's just like basketball, man. If you stand at the free throw line and you goddamn it, you know, if you're aiming backwards, you're you're fucked. <laughs> you know? Pretty much. Shit. I wrote a book on golf on the setup. Oh, I really? could take 10,000 people and line them up there and I'd show them every single one of them all at the same time exactly how to set up. Oh, wow. Because it's the same in every sport, believe it or not. Yeah. As a matter of fact, my younger son just came down. He lives up in Michigan. He had brought his girlfriend with him and she was. Jimmy, watch it. Oh, yeah. She, 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 she rode horses. I mean, uh -huh. you know, I mean, big time. Oh, wow. And so I was going to bring them out. You know, she's never played golf. And I'm thinking, how can I relate, relate all this to her? Somebody yeah. who just has ridden horses. Yeah. And I thought, hey, what does she do when she fucking saddles the horse? The horse is sitting over here. She picks it, right, grabs that fucking saddle, and like throwing, like throwing the tire, right? Yep. Hey, she grabs that fucking saddle and goes. Right on there. What the fuck? She, she just made, <laughs> she just made the move. Yeah. It's a move. Yeah. It's like your tire deal. Absolutely. Yeah. It's going to be the same thing about passing basketball. It's just it ain't as hard as people think. Yeah. You know, the golf ball is there for a reason, and there's certain things that have to happen, and you got to hit it. Look at that, Jimmy. Get your little, little lay down. Man, I was telling you what, I was having so much fun yesterday hitting this, uh, hitting that, uh, that stinger. Uh, yes. Oh boy, I was loving that. I tell you what, buddy, that that's a money maker, buddy. I was I was loving that shot. Hold your finish now. Hold your finish. Hold your hey. After you hit it, hold it until it stops rolling. Four seconds. Okay. Not the four. Yeah. Okay. Jimmy, I'll take that. The old yeah. shots on this day like this, all day long. I know I got a lob wedge. You notice I, uh, I'm using your little trick here. What's that, buddy? Yeah, you're going to have to get higher. Go I, <laughs> it's you probably got a camera on it. You better get out of here. Yeah. <laughs> Don't be over here stealing stuff. <laughs> put the ball on the tee a little bit. There you go, yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. You showed me that one. Yeah. That yeah. makes a big difference. Yeah, you're big difference. Why you're learning, absolutely. And I get a lot more.
said a magic word there. It, golfs, it ain't nothing but a circle. You just got to know where to put it. Now, Jimmy, this is going to be, watch this Bruce Liskey cut shot. <laughs> yeah. With my, this Bruce Liskey there cut you go. shot. Oh, it was. Yeah. Boom. Set. Boom. Yep. Right there. Look at that. Yeah. I can cut that thing at will. I'm liking it, Jimmy, because, you know, I, I was building my swing. But back in the day, you know, we was always taught you could hit a three a three iron, you could hit anything in your bag. That's right, yeah. That's right. And and I used to practice with my three iron a lot. Now I don't really keep one in the bag. But I like the longer club. You know, now I'm swinging a little bit of the longer club just to get the feeling of my swing being out again. That's another reason that I call it ball location instead of ball position. Because to see if I put it in one particular spot, and let's say that I, you know, my arm wants to extend, but that spot or that location or that or that position I have it in is not conducive to where I'm extending to. Uh -huh. So that's why I call it ball location, so I can have it somewhere in the area. Because now I'm up starting to understand where, see where my ball position used to be uh -huh. in comparison to now my ball location. Now I'm in a position to where I can extend through it. And I can catch it every, and then that's where timing comes uh -huh. in. this is where this is down here uh -huh. you kind of get that tendency to do this do this and when you do that when you do that see what it does here in here that's 
you got to get up and start this here. Yeah, yeah. See? Okay? Right, that's, and, and risk in front of the ball, well, not behind. Yeah, yeah that, that's a good, yeah, you're, you're learning that. Well, okay. you got, you know, front, behind. Yeah, well, yeah, you were, you were, you were in a little bit of a weak, I call it a weak curve, but that's that, so go in front of your camera. Here, I'm gonna, hey, I'm gonna go over don't, and dance with you. Don't get me on if camera. it feels good, it's probably not right. That's different yeah. means change. Yeah. Put your hands forward a little bit, push them forward. There, there you go, right there. Now, now go. Now go, hold it. Okay. So you never see, you never see any good golfers. Watch this. You never see them in this position. Yeah. Like that. You're in this Always position. Always that way. Okay. Okay. Hey, this is Shade Tree Pro. Just chilling at the range. Always good golfer. 